Hey, hey, it's Rod with the Paddle Channel, and Tacoma and I just wanted to take a few minutes to enjoy the sun. I thought I'd uh, talk about one of my favorite pieces of gear for the Outrigger canoe, and that would be if you like to take photos or video while you're paddling or on your canoe, then I think this is an essential piece of gear, or at least I found it to be. Uh, and that would be, of course, I like to shoot with a GoPro, but my, my favorite piece of gear for taking the GoPro along uh, would be a JAWS mount like this. Now you can get a lot, you can get these uh, off of Amazon, GoPro has their own model. This is the same top, and I've had two of these same top models, got it off of Amazon. Uh, price is great. I've found them to be, uh, that they hold up really well. Uh, but with this type of mount, you know, you've got adjustability, you can change direction. You can put this on the, on the uh, rear Yaku and change direction very, very quickly. Uh, you can put it on the front, Yaku can get a, a um, uh, get different views. Um, I've even mounted it to the splash guard over the footwell. Probably my favorite way to use this jaws mount is uh, on an extension pole mounted off the front Yaku and it gives a really cool view especially when you're downwinding kind of gives a little more uh, perspective on the size and shape of, of the bumps that you're riding on. But I have found this to be an essential piece of gear um, I invite you to check it out. It's uh, it's held up pretty well. I did have you do see we get a little bit of rust in here uh, I typically just treat that with some uh, lime juice and salt it takes the rust off pretty well And then I keep it oiled up um, You do have to if you're paddling salt water you do need to rinse it out of course uh, Every time you paddle, but I found you, you're still gonna get rust no matter how well you rinse after each paddle So you just keep an eye on it. Uh, I did have a failure on one with this pin right here, but that was after a couple of years of paddling and uh, I don't know how many hours in salt water. One thing though, is that you can, now this has been in a lot of rough surf. I've had it on the canoe uh, and gotten hammered going out through the inlets and just playing in the surf. And I've hoolied with it. Um, I've only knocked it off. This, this will separate. If you hit this hard enough, these accordion balls will separate. So you do have to be aware of that so definitely I would have uh, whether you've got an old GoPro like this I definitely have some type of life jacket or um, uh, floating mount on your GoPro but again check it out it's a good piece of gear